Hey guys, it's Pastor John with Corndale Church. Just want to take a few moments to remind you of three important things that are taking place this weekend. Number one is that uh, we're losing an hour of sleep Saturday night. So do make sure you set your clocks forward and uh, maybe head to bed a little bit earlier and maybe make the coffee extra strong on Sunday morning. But do make sure that you do set your clocks. Otherwise, your whole day is going to be off. Number two. Our service times are going to be changing on this Sunday. Currently, we meet at 9, 15, and 11. We are rolling those service times back 15 minutes. So we're going to start now at 9 o'clock and at 10.45. So if you forget your clock and you forget the service times, your whole Sunday is going to be messed up. So make sure you set the clocks back and know 9 o'clock is the first service and 1045 is the second service. The third change that's gonna be taking place has to do with our kids programming. This Sunday will be the first Sunday that we invite elementary two uh, to be with us for the entire service and moving forward, it's our plans that they will just join us uh, in the sanctuary for our Sunday services. So elementary two will be uh, with us. Also, we've been talking about a kid's journal and so I'll let you know that we do have the journals in. Uh, they're actually really helpful and well designed and it's help it's intended to help our kids uh, kind of follow the order of the service. And so there's places to fill in what was the verse for the call to worship? What did it mean? What were some of the big words? Uh, what are we repenting of? Uh, how are we being reminded of, of uh, God's grace and his forgiveness in our lives? And so uh, here's a little sneak peek of what they look like. These will be available for you uh, on Sunday. And so this is especially for our elementary two kids that are joining us. And then the other part of that change is that uh, elementary one, and pre-K are going to be with us in the service for the first segment of the service, and then they will be dismissed to their classes uh, at the greeting time. So in the past, we had elementary one, elementary two with us. They were dismissed at greeting. This Sunday, elementary two is going to stay with us the whole day. Elementary one and pre-K will be with us for the beginning of the service, and at the greeting time, they will be dismissed. And we realize this is going to be a transition. Some of us are going to forget, and so there's going to be some speed bumps, kind of like learning to drive a clutch for the first time. We get it. We're going to allow time for grace and growth, but want to make sure that you kind of know this is the Sunday that those changes are going to be making uh, taking place. So set your clocks forward. Make sure you know it's 9 o'clock and 10.45. Elementary 2 is going to be with us the whole time. Elementary 1, pre-K, in the service for the beginning, dismissed at the greeting. Those are the three things you need to know. And uh, hope that that's helpful. Hopefully you can remember all of that. And if you don't, we'll also give you some uh, help and support this Sunday. All right. Hope to see you soon. Hope you're doing well. And uh, we will see you on Sunday.